everybody. Um, so for maths today, we are doubling again um, and doing double problems. So the first thing I'd like you to do is go on a double hunt. So I've got two pencils. So I want you to go in your house and find double two pencils. So remember, double, if I had three pencils, double would be three and three. So I'd need to get the same amount again. So if I've got two pencils, I want you to double it and go and find me another two. Okay, and then when you found it, you can come back. You might need to pause the video. And next, I would like you to find me... I'm trying to think of things that you might have in your house. I've got three pieces of paper. I want you to go find double that. Double three pieces of paper. Okay. I've got five pencils, and I would like you to go find double that. Okay, so if you just do a little bit of doubling with items, um, you can do it as a little scavenger hunt like that, or you could just ask them to just double some numbers for you. Um, watch the doubles song, and then I've got a doubles problem. Okay, uh, Mrs. blessard has got three pounds, but Miss Harrison has got double this. And I want to know, how much money has Miss Harrison got? I don't know, she got more than me, less than me. So see if you can work that out and find out how much more money Miss Harrison has than me. If she has double what I've got, I've got three pounds. Okay, I'm gonna underline the number, three pounds, and she's got double. So see if you can work that out. Grown-ups, if you think that was quite easy, um, give your children a few other problems with higher numbers to work out. Um, if they found that quite tricky, go for a slightly lower number and use objects to work it out. Okay.